The shoe I'm holding here is the Spring Summer 13 Hoka 1-1 Bondi, Bondi 2 in fact, and we have a few key changes at the Bondi. It remains the same as far as the outsole, uh, more road friendly outsole, same midsole in terms of uh, every aspect, so still the same stack height of 36 and 32 millimeters, still the same shore in the EVA. The big difference for us is gonna be in the upper. We go to a hexagon, really breathable uh, upper, so essentially you have a mesh material, a hexagon pattern. We soften the ankle pocket area of the shoe as well to allow you to get in there. Uh, we add a nice heel loop, or tongue loop and heel loop as well, get the shoe on nice and quickly and easily. We give it a thin ortho light liner for those people that have that little bit higher volume foot, uh, you'll be able to replace that thermal molded EVA and put something that's gonna give you a little bit more volume. That's the Bondi 2, look for it in stores, spring, summer 13. I'm holding the Stinson Tarmac. A lot of you folks out there have been asking about the Stinson Tarmac and what the differences are between this and the Stinson Evolution. And it's really one simple thing, the outsole. You'll notice that we give it a strict road outsole. Uh, really smooth, really low rolling resistance. We do isolate that first metatarsal for really good first metatarsal drop and uh, really good feedback when you're running on the road. Uh, what you'll notice is we give it a quick lace system um, out of the box. It also comes with a regular lacing system that you're welcome to uh, replace it with if you'd like. Comes with a pre-molded EVA as well as an ortholock light sock liner. This is a great shoe for all you folks that are out there running uh, in those half marathon, those marathon distance, uh, as well as those half Ironman and full Ironman uh, races. Be sure to check out the Stinson Tarmac at your nearest Hoka dealer. Stinson Evolution. The Stinson Evolution is the third shoe for Hoka uh, and has a couple really nice changes that are really significant to the ride of the shoe. Uh, namely, we narrow the forefoot, isolate that first metatarsal, uh, and we go to 39 and 33 and a half inch stack height, so a five and a half millimeter drop and a slightly stiffer EVA. So the shoe's gonna have a more precise ride. Uh, it's gonna be a bit more nimble when you're running more technical single track. Uh, it does come with a quick lace system uh, as well as regular lacing system in the box and two liners, a uh, thin ortholite liner uh, for those of you that have a little bit higher volume foot. Uh, be sure to check out the Stinson Evolution at your local Hoka 1-1 dealer.